Hi there, it's Valdesta from wildgirl.com and I'm going to take you through the process of nuking your interface and uh, WTF folders safely. I'm on a Macintosh here and all you're doing right now is looking at my background and uh, my things that I can launch along the bottom. I'm going to go into my applications and open it up. I understand many people are on PC, but it'll be basically the same thing, because what you want to do is go into your C drive and go into your World of Warcraft directory under program files, and you want to find a couple of directories. One of them is the interface directory, and if you list them alphabetically, it might be easier to find some of this. Maybe not, because I've got all this crap. These uh, patch download things you can get rid of because you've already downloaded the patch and installed it. So I'm going to trash those just because they get in the way. Okay, so now we can see that we have the WTF folder and the interface folder and these are the ones that when you have problems with your interface or you're having problems getting uh, when you're logging out it's taking a lot of time and it's disconnecting you and stuff. Um, if you're having troubles these are the first two folders that the World of Warcraft support people are gonna ask you to reset. So before you even worry about any kind of support this is the first thing that you should do. But what I recommend is that you don't actually delete these folders, that you actually keep them but you just make it so that the World of Warcraft game recreates them for you. Note, when you do this, you're going to lose a whole bunch of settings. That's why I say that you shouldn't delete the folder, you should just uh, rename it and uh, let the game recreate the folders. So then if you do want to uh, restore your folders for some reason to recover some information, you can do that. So here we go, we're just going to rename this WTF folder. I'm going to rename it WTF2. Interface, name it Interface 2. So if I go into Interface, you can see under my Add-ons folder here that I have lots and lots of add-ons installed. I'm sure more pe some people have more. But anyway, so now I've got an Interface 2 directory and I've got a WTF2 directory. And as soon as I restart the game, World of Warcraft will recreate the WTF folder and the Interface folder. And any troubles that I was having with the game should be handled. At that point, then you can reinstall your add-ons and reconfigure your game. 